How's it going everybody? Welcome to Lunar Trading. In this video, I'll be going over my levels and plan for SPY tomorrow. So let's jump right into it. SPY was down 1.74% today. We had our FOMC meeting, which right afterwards we saw some pretty intense volatility in the market. Price came down and touched our support zone, bouncing perfectly out of it and then came up to our resistance zone and then pulled back from there, eventually breaking underneath our support zone. So congrats to anybody that played these levels that we've been watching for a while now. But for tomorrow, keep an eye on this support zone from 382 to 380 and then this support zone from 373 to 371. Mainly keep an eye on this zone since we have broken under this first one and this will probably act as an area of resistance going forward just because it was a decent support area so a lot of times when price breaks underneath and holds for a respectable amount of time when it comes back up and retest it we'll see a rejection but for resistance levels to keep an eye on is first this zone up here from 388 to 390 and then this second zone up here from 395 to 396 and i'm going to delete this third zone just because I don't think we need to watch it anymore. Also, keep an eye on this downtrend that we've been watching for a while. I'm going to delete this previous uptrend since we're pulling further away from it and it's becoming less relevant to us right now. But my plan going into tomorrow is I'm going to watch to see if price comes down into the support zone. If it does, I'm going to be looking to grab some calls, probably light, maybe medium size, depending on the setup. But if we break underneath this zone, we're going to be heading lower and testing low 360s and maybe even break even lower. So I wouldn't be too bullish on the market right now. But if price does come up and retest this first support zone, I may grab some puts off of it just because it could be treated as an area of resistance. Again, it depends on the setup. Maybe if we have a intraday uptrend forming and then if I see that break and we're also in this zone, then I'll look to grab some puts and ride them down. And if price does somehow manage to climb up to this resistance zone up here, then I will also be looking to grab puts. And I'll probably position medium to heavy size. But I do expect the market to continue heading lower. We might just see some chop tomorrow or there's a good chance we could see a gap down and then price continue to drop even further but i'll alert any trade i take in the discord link down below if you guys want to join that where i give out my free trading alerts and also you can chat with me and other traders and we can all learn and grow together and also subscribe to the channel if you like these short and sweet technical videos i try to do them daily i'm going to be trying to post more educational content on this channel as well but i hope everyone has a good rest of your day take care